Props to all the young people who uh, speak their truth. Appreciate y'all. Hello, my name is Shisung Pung Yu Mo. I go by Pung Yu or Pan Yu in English phonics. As many of you know, recently in Baraboo, Wisconsin, a large group of mostly white male students took a picture giving the Nazi salute. However, the district chose not to characterize their behavior as criminal, but rather an act of free speech. A group identity that has a history of genocide and still commits murderous hate crimes today is considered free speech and not criminal. A group of 100 black male teenagers throw up a hand sign in a picture. The National Guard would be called in. The FBI would be investigating the black identity extremist gang activity in Wisconsin. Sadly, I don't know if this is a joke or maybe closer to the truth. Racism exists and it exists here in Wisconsin. Young people of color are more likely to be criminalized than young white people. Racial biases and racial disparities damage the lives of young people, the young people of color. Cops in schools do not support the education of students of color, particularly black students, but rather threaten their safety, especially in an institution that is supposed to be dedicated to the development and growth of young people. Young people of color should not be criminalized for behavior that is normal for growing children and teenagers, like talking in class or throwing pencils. Remove cops from schools. Also, I offer a better policy solution for MMSD that would increase safety for all students. Support culturally appropriate curriculum that engages students of color by celebrating the, ident the identities of students of color, like the resolutions supporting Hmong history education introduced in La Crosse and already passed in Eau Claire and DC Everest Walsall area school districts, and of which would also teach white students in Wisconsin to humanize non-white students so they don't celebrate the genocide of non-white peoples. I support Freedom Inc.'s No Cops in Schools campaign, and we demand that you remove cops from schools, invest resources in education that promotes <laughs> leadership, wellness, learning, and creativity for youth of color, build transformative justice instead of punishing youth, and give youth and families decision-making po decision power. Thank you. <laughs>